What is going on YouTube? It is your boy Daddy Mac and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. We are within the second Wi-Fi battle, or video I should say, with our Hatterene team, our Gigantamax Hatterene team. And we are against Fire Wraith Fire Wraith 1. It sounds like that's an attack out of Fire Emblem or something. That's pretty cool. That's a really cool name. He has a cool team. I have not seen it in DD, but that is why we're packing the expanded uh, expanding force, ladies and gents. Table I have not seen since Generation Six, to be honest with you. Sylveon's a cool Pokemon to see. So is the Haxorus and the Scolipede, which probably has a um, speed boost. But the question is, who he is going to start with? Um, I honestly don't mind starting Hatterene here. No, we're bringing one Pokemon. What is wrong with me? I'm gonna have to forfeit this and hopefully they accept my rematch. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I hope it's the same leads too. I can't believe I messed it up, my boys. I messed it up so bad. I messed it up so bad. Okay. We are. We're gonna restart. We have to restart. Okay, so we're gonna start Hatterene. Go High Dragon, Salazzo, Berserker, Araquanid, and Dusclops. Don't mess it up again this time. I felt so bad. Hopefully, he starts with um, Sableye again. I brought the six Pokemon this time, I promise you. I, I'm not gonna mess it up again. I'm so upset because on the last Wi Fi battle, I misclicked. And I ended up, um, I almost got to myself the Wi-Fi battle. But, I'm not going to spoil the rest of that. I'm not going to tell you exactly how it turned out. Because, it's a good Wi-Fi battle. You guys should check it out. So, Sableye versus Hatterene here. Dame lead, so thank you so much for uh, Fire Wraith. The first thing I want to try to do, she's probably going to try to predict the uh, fairy type attack. I'm honestly going to go Mystical Fire here. Um, I do kind of want to do that, to be honest. In case an Assault Vest Pokemon wants to go, or a special attacking Pokemon wants to come in. Taunts. I don't mind that. I'm not Trick Room. A lot of people think, think I'm Trick Room, but I am not Trick Room. I should have just gone for the Dazzling Gleam. Alright, so Mystical Fire. Gonna do a little bit of damage. Lowers the special attack stat. And uh, shows me the leftovers. So then here, I'm honestly okay going with the Dazzling Gleam. I'm okay going Dazzling Gleam. Goes for the knockoff. Oh, there goes my assault vest. That's not good. Because Hadrian's not that good with the assault vest, at least in my opinion. At least for my EV spread. Okay. I'm in trouble. Hadrian is in trouble. We're in big trouble. Skullipede comes out. Which is going to threaten me with the poison type attack. And that is why we're not staying in. Um, At the same time, I kind of want to go... Uh, Aquanade. I'm gonna go Dusclops here because we can take a physical attack from the Skullipede and we can threaten it with the Will-O-Wisp. I don't think I saw any fire type Pokemon in this team or her team. So, Poison Jab. That's what I figured. We resist that easily. And then here comes the Speed Boost. And we're not we're not really in trouble, but we kind of are. I'm gonna will this here. If you want to hit me with something else, feel free. Feel free because a will o wisp is probably gonna make this thing kind of useless. Everybody's like, yeah, who's gonna win this? They're probably going for um, fire rate, to be honest. They probably saw me start and they were like, all right, since they made the exception, this guy's kind of stupid or something. Indeed, he comes out. That is interesting. Obviously, a burn isn't going to matter to this thing, but Psychic Surge comes out. Psychic Surge comes out. Um, my question is, does this thing pack the fight? No, the ghost type attack. Is this thing packing the ghost type attack? I obviously can't do anything against this Indeed right now. We are in the situation we wanted to be in originally. But I don't know where to go from here. So I'm going to go Araquanid. If you want to go Expanding Force, I'm going to cry a little bit. I'm not going to lie. 
I am not gonna lie. A rock one is gonna come out. Hopefully she goes for the ghost type attack if she's running it. Light screen. Interesting. And um my heart's starting to pound a little bit because this is gonna be this can be a little bit scary for us. Um honestly, water bubble. Take advantage of the water bubble and just go liquidation. That's my first initial thought. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go liquidation. Reflect. My boys, I'm kind of nervous right now. Alright, here comes the liquidation. Does a lot of damage, to be honest. And what is that? Weakness? And all of a sudden, I know I'm in trouble. I am in big trouble right now. Haxorus is gonna come in. Hit us with the dragon dance. And he's gonna make us cry. This Bad boy, Haxorus is gonna make us cry. I have nothing for this. I don't got anything because after that uh, dragon dance, we're in big trouble. We are in huge trouble. He's gonna go sword dance or dragon dance. I hope it's the sword dance because at least if it's dragon, if it's sword dance, I can try to outspeed it. I'm scared. Door stance. Okay, that makes me feel a little bit better. Not too much, to be honest with you. Um, try to will o wisp, I guess. That's my best. That's my best chance. He's gonna dynamax and sweep my team. Scales. We dodge it, boys. And the will o wisp goes into play. That is huge. That is really huge. That is huge. I cannot believe it right now. I cannot believe my luck. Okay. I'm going to Nightshade here as much as I want to predict another uh, Scale Shot. He's probably going to go Scale Shot next turn right here. And we're just going to try to block that out. That's going to be the initial goal. So Nightshade, now he's at normal attack. No, he's at a plus two now for sure. Light screen wears off, which is kind of nice to be honest. I'm gonna predict the scale shot and go Hattering here to get a little bit more burn damage. So that's what we're gonna do. Hopefully he doesn't lose that and go for another sword zaps. Okay, he read that like a book. We read that as much as uh, as perfect as we wanted it to. Okay, so we're not going to let this thing set up a scale shot on us. We're going to go Dazzling Gleam right here. Assuming Iron Tail. Miss? Nope, not missing. That's going to knock us out. I respect that. My question is, is this thing Scarf? Or not Scarf. Obviously, it's not. Is this thing a Jolly Nature? Because if it's Jolly Nature, we're kind of in trouble, to be honest. I'm going to go Berserker here because we resist the scale shot. The last thing I want is for this thing to get its speed boosted. Which is why we're going Berserker right now. I'm going to go Iron Head. I'm just going to go Iron Head. We have speed it. We show that we're Choice Guard. We played around this Haxorus just barely. Just barely. Depending on what he goes into, we're going to capitalize. Or try to capitalize. We're going to try to capitalize. I'm so proud of how we played around that. So proud. And honestly, I'm going to go into Deathclops every single time against the Skull of Beef. If this thing wants to go towards that, let it be. But we're going to try to prevent everything we can from being swept. Earthquake, we should be able to take that as expected. And then I kind of want to predict the Ndidi here, so we're going to switch it up. We're going to switch out. Double switch into your boy. A dragon? Berserker. A dragon? Berserker. A dragon? Berserker. A dragon? Maybe even a Rockwinid. I'm going to go a Rockwinid. Because we do have the Leech Life. Oh, he stays in. Okay. He is staying in right now. And he's Dynamaxing. Make things worse. Okay. Our Dynamax Pokemon got knocked out. 
including last battle. We don't have. I think we should start taxing out our Dynamax levels. Just in case our Dynamax or our Gigantamax Pokemon gets knocked out. Because you never know, you know? Max Quake. Hopefully, we live it. Hopefully. Now, the question is is this thing running a rock type attack? Because if it is, we're kind of in trouble, if I'm being honest with you. Um, I'm gonna hit it with the water bubble. Lunch, maybe. Lunch? Lunch is kind of tempting, to be honest. Lunch is really tempting. So is liquidation, though. I'm gonna lunch here because this thing is bulky. I'm not gonna be able to knock it out. Ah, uh, he's running the rock type attack. That is what I was fearing, to be honest. And we just get knocked out, my boys. Okay, so I think we Dynamax here, and we have to try to survive this thing. We have to try to live against it as much as we can. The question is, who do we, who do, who do we, uh, you know, go out to? He's running Poison Jab, and he's probably running the the, uh, the other attack too. I think we're gonna go high dragon here. We're gonna try to bait out the the, uh, the uh, bug type attack. If he's running Mega Horn, that is. I'm gonna go into Salazzle here. We're gonna try to bait out the attack. That's 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 that's, a, that's one we. She she has a really threatening team, to be honest with you. Yeah, here comes here comes that bug type attack. Really good job. She did a really good job. We did a fantastic job. My team took a hit, for sure. My team took a big hit. This thing is just getting boosted it's so crazy right now. It's not even funny. Okay, so he has a Porygon Z in the back. And DD. Porygon Z and DD Sylveon. So we kind of still need our Pokemon. We still need some of our Pokemon. Um, I don't think we let... Um, that's not to take a, as much damage anymore. We're gonna, we're gonna try to live an attack or at least dodge a rock slide. Uh, no, he has an earthquake. I forgot about that. I forgot about that. Okay, so Lazo goes down. He is punching holes on my team. Like, big holes. They're not those little itty bitty, uh, um, uh, hell, hell deaths. This is damage. This is really big damage. I'm gonna go Dust Ops here because it's the best chance that I have. It's the best chance that I have. Do I will o -wisp? I should have will o -wisp. If I will o -wisp, that would have been a game changer. I'm going to will o -wisp here. I have to will o -wisp here. What am I doing? Earthquake, live it. We have to. It's not boosted. You have to live this. Yes! I expected that, but still, you never know what happens in Pokemon. Okay. Part of me wants to call mine. And then rest, because if he switches out... I a Calm Mind is going to basically tell me that I live an attack from a Pokemon he switches into. At least one or two. What is your speed at, Skolipede? You're at... You're probably at plus six. Let's be honest. Is this the last turn of sand? Is this the last turn of sand? Yes. Okay, so we won't take damage here. We're going to Calm Mind. Try to live an attack. Gotta try to live an attack. Okay, we, we're living an attack. I'll mind here. And then we're resting it up. We're resting it up. I do not care about the NDD right now. That's in the least... That That's back here. Right now in front of my head is the Skolipede. Is the Skolipede. Okay. So now we're going to rest it up. My team is, ca is... It's bulky. It's bulky for a reason. If this team wasn't as bulky as it is right now, we would have been in a whole different situation right now. We would have been in a really big situation right now. I'm going to rest it up here. And, he, and they probably got annoyed by seeing this rest. Because this Dust Lops is getting annoying. And it's whittling down their, their uh, power points. Okay. Um, it's a good thing I went for a plus one. Her team is still really threatening. It's really threatening. We're just going to... We're just going to stay on the field. Porygon Z comes out. Probably has the Shadow Ball, too. At least we, we get to stay in a little bit. 
I'm gonna continue to nitrate it. And I know it's not the best thing in the world, but still. Porygon Z glitching a little bit. What is, does Porygon Z get nasty plot in this generation? If it does, we're in trouble. If it does, we're in big trouble. I cannot tell you the trouble that we're gonna be in if it does carry the nasty plot. This is a really good battle. This is the kind of battle you pay for if Pokemon were real. Pay per view, my boys. This is an intense battle. I'm sweating it up. I'm sweating it up, and that's probably gross to you guys, but it's it's hot. My AC is not working. It's summer. It's the end of summer almost. I'm trying to drink as much water as I can, and I didn't even take the, the tag off of this water bottle. She's probably trying to time her saw at this point. And it's understandable. Hyper Beam. We're not switching, my boys. My question is, if they use Hyper Beam, do they have to recharge? They probably do. So I'm going to Berserk her here. We're Scarfed. Hopefully, we should be able to take an attack from this Porygon Z. I mean, we got rid of the... Oh, they Rage Quitted. I didn't mean to stall you out. I'm sorry. I am so sorry do another Wi-Fi battle because of that? I kind of do. We're at 70 minutes though. They probably realized they couldn't get through my Dusclops. That was such a good battle. I really wish it came down to the last one. Alright, we're gonna find another opponent. So there's a server maintenance going on in Pokemon Sword and Shield right now, so really bad timing for us, unfortunately. So we're gonna have to call it a video right here. I owe you guys two Wi-Fi battles on, on Friday's video because... Of this one that my opponent rage quitted and then the one on Friday so I owe you guys two Wi-Fi battles we will do both of those on Friday I promise you guys that but thank you guys so much for watching this video I really appreciate it make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed that Wi-Fi battle that was an awesome Wi-Fi battle I do not know how I survived that much firepower from the Haxorus from the Scolipede that was insane ladies and gentlemen but make sure you guys leave a like because that was an awesome Wi-Fi battle Comment down below on your vote for the MVP, most valuable Pokemon. And subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battles. It is your boy Daddy Max signing off. I will see you guys next time.